Hey, how's it going, guys? Mr. Boss for the win here. And in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video, I'm actually going to be talking to you guys about next generation Grand Theft Auto 5. We're going to be looking at some new screenshots that give us exclusive details about digital content, more pre order bonuses, transferring our character, and exclusive content for returning players. So again, I'm very excited to bring you guys this information. So if you are new or like videos like this, please feel free to hit that subscribe button and you can catch all my daily Grand Theft Auto 5 videos like this. With out of the way, guys, let's get started. So that's right, yesterday the PlayStation Store actually added a preload page for Grand Theft Auto 5 on the PlayStation 4. And there are three new screenshots that give us a little bit of information on what is exactly going to be happening. So I mentioned yesterday that Grand Theft Auto 5 was going to require a minimum of 50 gigabytes of download space on your PlayStation 4, and I'm assuming Xbox One hard drive, and I also talked about the possibility of getting 300,000 extra Grand Theft Auto Online dollars as part of like an exclusive bonus. Now today we've gotten information that a digital exclusive pre-order bonus of $300,000 can be earned when you pre-order GTA 5 on the PlayStation 4 by November 3rd and it's the digital exclusive only so if you're kind of on the fence on whether you want to get Grand Theft Auto 5 for a physical copy or a digital copy you can get 300,000 extra Grand Theft Auto Online dollars if you pre-order by November 3rd and you make it a digital exclusive now some more common details basically this confirms that you can preload Grand Theft Auto 5 on your PlayStation 4 and it will be available to play on November 18th at midnight Eastern time. So wherever you're located in the world it's going to be on the 18th of November Eastern time and you'll be able to play Grand Theft Auto 5. Now the next screenshot actually talks about transferring your character. So existing players on PlayStation 3 or Xbox 360 can transfer their GTA Online characters and progression to PlayStation 4. So I've actually read a few forum posts about this. This includes not only your physical character but all of your stats, money, cars, apartments, everything. Everything transfers over to next generation. It's just not your character or it's not just your stats. Literally everything, cars, apartments, money, everything goes to next generation, which is why I think it is so awesome. So I'm just clearing things up right here. I know you guys probably knew a lot about this information already. But you can transfer literally everything from a PlayStation 3 or an Xbox 360 to a PS4 or an Xbox One. And finally, the last screenshot talks about exclusive content for returning players. And again, I know Rockstar's mentioned this on a previous Newswire post, but they mentioned new vehicles collectibles, weapons, and more. And the one I want to focus on right here is collectibles. What could that possibly mean? When I think of collectibles, I'm not really too sure what to think of. Like, I'm not really sure if this is like avatar things that you can use or if it's in-game, you know, items that will actually be helpful for story mode in Grand Theft Auto Online. So you guys are going to have to help me. What do these collectibles mean and what could they be? And what does the more thing, returning players get new vehicles, collectibles, weapons, and more? So this is crazy. Rockstar is, you know, crazily rewarding those guys who play on the Xbox 360 and the PS3 uh, for those guys who are going to be getting it on Next Generation as well. So I'm very excited about Grand Theft Auto V on the Next Generation. November 18th cannot come soon enough, and I am very excited to get my hands on Next Generation Grand Theft Auto V. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Be sure to leave a like on the video if you did enjoy. And of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are new or you like daily Grand Theft Auto V videos like this. Well, out of the way, guys, like I said, thanks for watching, take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.